A Midtown family woke up to a shocking scene outside of their home early this morning. A person drove straight through their cinder block wall, nearly hitting their house. Gabby Easterwood is joining us live from the house that's not too far from the Visitation Monastery. And Gabby, it looks like a lot of damage there. Yeah, Peter, the damage is still definitely evident here at this Midtown Mobile home. You can see cinder blocks all over the ground, and there's actually tire marks all the way through going up until the home. But thankfully, it did not hit the home. Totally was surprising. A rude awakening for one Midtown Mobile family when this stolen Toyota Camry crashed through their cement wall, which sits on the Spring Hill Boulevard side of their home. Emily Hansen, the homeowner, sending us these photos of the car still in their yard before police arrived. She tells us her and her two boys were asleep inside and had no idea what was happening until their dog began to bark. But at first, they didn't think much of it. I just thought it was the weather, and then I went to let him out about an hour later. Turned around and was like, what, what happened? The person who drove through the wall had already fled the scene once they came outside. The car even still in their yard, missing the home by a mere inches. I wasn't totally surprised because just that see people at that intersection and how crazy it is. Anyway, people fly through it. It's awful. Bottom line, Hansen is glad there was no major damage or injuries, this leaving her with a story to laugh at. Glad my dog hears everything, and uh, I'll, I'll probably be a little more alert when he's alert at stuff, and, you know, it all works and the way it's supposed to, so I'm just glad nobody was hurt. Now, MOBA police do tell us that they are still investigating because they do not know at this time who was the driver of that stolen vehicle, and they do not have any suspects. Reporting live in Midtown Mobile, I'm Gabby Easterwood, WKRG News 5.